I was going for a run no more than 30 minutes and it, it just happened instantly. Before I knew I had to you know, get a ride from a stranger and got dropped off at the university. Uh, one of our physicians was in the training table and he's like, yeah, he gotta, you know, you gotta get to get him to ER because he has a collapsed lung. And imagine a pop in the balloon and just there's nothing left. The point that happened, the lungs collapsed, the point we got to the hospital, it was about an hour. And what happened was there's so much air that was in the wrong spot that it starts to pressure my heart. So they were saying like, it could have, yeah, the doctor was like, it was really close that he got here because it could have been really ugly and you know, too much pressure could have his heart stop. So I guess mine was like uncommon and they had to like do like a microscopic surgery and remove a few things. So I ended up being in the hospital about a little over three weeks. After I got out of the hospital, they were like, you know, you go home and basically don't do anything. It was just my body versus my lungs, which was just like getting back to fitness, you know. And remember being, you, there was things that you used to just do with this amount of effort, now we're requiring this much. It was just like so much harder after, you know, 12, 15 months of not being really competitive. So, so I figured if I'm going to train, just do it all in and see what happens. <laughs>